Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have um, a really fun video for you guys. I saw on Instagram the other day that e.l.f. was releasing the Jelly Pop collection. So I know it was available on Ulta to buy. So I think it was, I want to say it was Tuesday, today's Friday. Um, I saw it was available to buy. So I went on and I picked up a couple of things that I was really interested in. And it all arrived today which I was really excited. So I was like, oh my God, I have to film this with you guys. So this is going to be a first impression and try on kind of review. So really quick, let's see. I ordered the Dew Primer. Actually, here we go. The Dew Primer. I ordered the Flush Blush in Peach Pop and Berry Pop. I also got Face and Eye Gloss Icy Pop. And I picked up the Stipple Brush, which almost looks like a blush brush with stippling stuff on it. So I gotta open these up. I just want the packaging is so cute, I wanted to show you guys. So I figured I'd do like a trial on with these and give you my thoughts and just do a very light makeup application with it. So first things first, the Jelly Pop Dew Primer. Um, honestly, I'm a sucker for anything that's like dewy or radiant, but just, I like it. So let's see. Okay. So, oh, it's so cool. It's like, there's like a bubble in there. Like a, look at that. <laughs> All right. Anyways, I'm gonna just put some on my my the back of my hand. I'm gonna put some on the back of my hand. Pump it a few times. It has a nice watermelon scent. That's what it looks like. It's it's clear. I mean, it's a very very faint pinkish color, but not really. Oh wow. That's like a serum. I was not expecting that. All right. You know what this feels like? You know when you guys do like, um, I don't know if you do this, but when you do a mask that peels off, like that consistency, that's what it reminds me of. It's nice and kind of like, it's thick. Mmm, smells good. It reminds me of um, almost like a Jolly Rancher, the watermelon scent. One, the one that tastes like watermelon, but it's softer. I don't mind it. It's very, uh, like a fresh kind of scent. It feels amazing. It definitely, is, definitely leaves the skin looking dewy and radiant. I like that. I'm sorry, my hair is kind of a mess today. I was trying to leave it down, but it's so hot and humid, I, I can't. All right, what do you guys think? Super pretty. This is good, like if you don't wanna wear makeup one day and you just wanna look really radiant, I like that. So far, so good. All right, so now that I have my foundation on and concealer, let's jump into the two blushes. So I got the two blushes that came with the collection and they are those like, they're like a jelly blush. So it comes like this. Um, the only thing about these, like um, these particular products from e.l.f. is they never have the name on the bottom, which is kind of like, oh no, wait, I'm lying. They're not on the bottom, they're on the side. I was wrong. So it's here, cool. So now I'll know which one I'm putting on. This is Peach Pop. I'll do one on one cheek and then I'll do Berry Pop on the other. Look at that. <laughs> Let me put this over here so it doesn't fall. Mm, this has the watermelon scent too. It's very soft. It's very soft. I like that. I'm going to scoop a little bit out and put it in the back of my hand. Just that. It's a pretty color. I feel like a little was gonna go a long way, so we're gonna work lightly. So first I'm gonna try with my fingers. And smile a little bit. It 
it's sheer but there's some color to it and when I turn you can see the light really catches it gives it a nice glowing look so where it oh, let's try with the brush that it came with I'm just gonna dip it in see how that applies it same color this is the peach pop All right let me just take a closer look it's funny it's I would almost call it more of like a highlighter you know, I wouldn't, like, if you were just looking to use it as a blush, like, with color, I don't know that it would give you a lot of color, if that's what you're looking for. But if you just want, like, that sheer, like, wash of color, I think this is perfect. So that was the peach one. I'm gonna try the berry pop now. Let me open this one. Oops. Oop. Same thing with scent. I'm gonna, oh, really quick. This is the peach one, kind of um, swatched on my hand. Close, I just feel like if I, if I have this on my little desk in front of me, but I feel like if it tips over, it's all gonna fall out. So just make sure you close it when you're done scooping it out or you're done using it because then all the product's gonna be on your vanity, your desk, whatever. So now with this one, I'm gonna go in with, I have an e.l.f. other sibling brush, this one. You're gonna go in with that one to see what happens. I'm going to go like this first, just to blend it out, just to get a, like a small amount on the brush. That's gorgeous. And I'm gonna smile and stipple it on. I think I put too much, so I'm gonna put the excess here. And now I'm gonna blend it out. This one has more color, it seems. Unless it's the brush that makes it uh, that picks up the color better but this one has more color i'm just going over a little bit with my finger those are pretty i like it yeah so with these particular blushes again if you're looking for something sheer like i think this is perfect for the summer like very easy very sheer very glowing i think these are amazing it's funny because when you put them on like this it's very colorful but when you put them onto your skin you know they you can work it into layers and i'm sure you can build the color more um but i do love the nice glow that it's leaving like that effect i love it all right next well the last part of the collection that i ordered was the face and eye gloss this, it's so funny because I couldn't really, t I was looking at the pictures to see like what, what it would look like. Um, and this one just looked like that nice dewy, like that editorial gloss um, that you see in like the magazines. So I'm very curious to see it. But however, in the packaging, I see that it's kind of glittery. We'll see. Moment of truth. Are you a gloss or are you more glitter? at that that's really cool looking all right let's see let's see I'm gonna just take some with my spatula uh, I'm gonna swatch it over here look at that this one's not as watery as the blushes which is very interesting hmm I see sparkle in it but I'm curious to see if it's gonna translate like sparkly on the skin let's try the eye it definitely has that nice wet look such an interesting consistency consistency yeah the, there's like there's sparkle in it but it's very very like minute This kind of reminds me of like a lip gloss. The glow is really pretty. I mean, unless you're like, bam, in my face, you could see the sparkles, but 
I think I can I think I can live with this because I hate um, highlighters that have like chunky glitter in it I don't like it um I just I feel like maybe I'm too old for that I don't know but this this I can do that's a real that's a serious glow like this is just the blush and that's the blush and the glow like that's amazing I'm even myself out yeah but uh, so yeah this this definitely has like some glitter in it but it's so it's so fine there's there's some glitter in it for sure but it's not it's not big glitter it's not chunky it's not like um extenuating like any texture or anything but I, I think this is really nice oh my god yeah I'm impressed it was this shade and there was like a pinkish one I didn't go for the pinkish one because anything that's kind of like it's too pink it doesn't I don't like the way it translates on my skin so yeah very minimal makeup I totally didn't do my eyebrows um but I really want to get this review out for you guys so I'm gonna leave it at that it's definitely like glowing skin for sure glowing skin for sure I love it yeah if you guys picked up this collection let me know comment down below um if you have any questions feel free to just comment down don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video